Everything we would see in the next episode number 48 of Super Dragon Ball Heroes, episode 47 has been a complete madness by presenting the return of unexpected enemies that once faced the Z-Warriors and the upcoming episode number 48, seems to be even more shocking as the title and synopsis details that it will be centered on Jiren and there is speculation of a possible power-up or even a fusion for the Martian from Universe 11. Episode 48, A Union That Transcends Spacetime, The Fist of Justice That Crushes Evil, the title of The Fist of Justice emphasizes Jiren, the only member of the Pride Troop who is in the field, and the word union in Dragon Ball Heroes has been used to refer to a merger between two individuals. Therefore there is the possibility of a possible fusion of Jiren in this next chapter. But another possibility is that the part of the union that transcends spacetime refers only to a collaboration between Jiren and someone else to face a powerful enemy. Let's say that Jiren goes to the aid of Goku who is clearly in trouble right now, and both join in battle to fight against Demigra. Although what does not fit at this point is that Jiren could not reach Goku's location since this requires traveling between dimensions. Gogeta Xeno was able to reach Goku Goku's location, because he broke through the dimension he was in as we saw him in the manga, making his way to save Goku from the One Star Dragon's attack. Another possibility of this possible union of Jiren with someone else, is that it refers to a union by synchronization as happened with Goku and Goku Zeno in previous chapters to face Fu. This would not be a physical union where the users join their bodies but it is a collaboration between the two fighting in coordination and boosting their strength to the maximum. This requires the presence of the Supreme Kai of Time Kronoa, and she is just with Goku and the others. But certainly the title of the next episode is quite confusing, but what do you think who do you think Jiren could merge with and well we are talking about Super Dragon Ball Heroes, where everything is possible. And well let's go now with a brief review of Chapter 47, previously Demigra released several enemies from the past, to help him in his plan of total extermination and domination of the timelines, ancient villains have returned from different spacetimes, and I have been introducing you some in my previous videos, but in the promotional anime many more were revealed, and now it turns out that Demigra has boosted the power of the enemies he has summoned, so that each could rival the current levels of the Z-Warriors, Demigra openly asks them to use the power gain to mercilessly slaughter their opponents. The Supreme Kai of Time Kronoa also asks everyone that at this time it is ideal that those who are grouped together join forces to face this great threat should also highlight the Battle of Gogeta Xeno Super Saiyan 4 Limit Breaker, a titanic fight that we have been waiting for two months. And there are many references to the battle moves between the two, are identical to those of Broly Full Power and Gogeta Super Saiyan Blue, from the Dragon Ball Super Broly movie, even the attack throwing a lot of blasts, is similar to the one we saw in the movie. Demigra for his part finally starts to move, it seems that he has already mastered the Dark King power he obtained although, for now his opponent is Goku and the Supreme Kai of Time Eos, but she unfortunately was defeated very easily, trying to freeze Demigra with a technique called Eternal Labyrinth with which she intends to freeze Demigriff forever. In the meantime, Goku has not yet recovered his strength, so he is forced to fight using only the Super Saiyan Blue and later the Super Saiyan Blue Kaioken, I imagine therefore, in two or three more episodes, Goku will use the Ultra Instinct again but it will be enough to defeat Demigra. And well friends until here with the preview of episode 48 of Super Dragon Ball Heroes, if you like the video give like comment and do not forget to subscribe, thank you for watching this video and see you soon.